Oh my God, there's a dead animal. What is that? What is that? This production will be presented in two parts. Here in part one, we zero in on a specific segment of the upcoming full-length movie, which will be released at a later date. I do not see where we could have missed this plastic and this disturbing scene when we walked the trail this morning on our way to the lake. We did not film this section of the trail during the walk-in, so we have no way of confirming that the incident took place while we were in the area. When I referred back to some clips from the full episode, you can see what I mean. It makes me wonder, what was Nancy really hearing when we were down at the lake? I just heard something up there. It sounded like kind of a squeal or a horn. Up there? Down. Yeah, it went. Did you hear that again? A civic sump? Or what was no, it? No, it was a Oh, you got way better hearing than I do. Here I notice that she is pointing in the same area that seems to be in question. All right, you just keep hearing the same thing, don't you? Yeah. All right, well, you've got, you can pick up those high notes. What the hell is that noise? Nancy, you with your supersonic hearing. I do not know what you're hearing. It sounds like an alarm. Well, we don't have an alarm. I know. Nearing the end of our two-day expedition, who knew what discovery awaited us during our search that Easter? Well, we are about to find out. Look at this, kindling. Wow. Oh, wait a minute. What the heck are these? Excellent kindling. Yeah, I'm going to take it. Oh, we, That's we cedar. Well, that is cedar. Isn't that nice? Yeah, we're taking this. Absolutely, man. Man, that's nice. Why are the ends burn off like that? Why would they do that? I don't know. Some they tried to start a fire. Ritual? But they didn't split it swollen. Just the ends though? Almost like it's some kind of ritual. Oh my god, there's a dead animal. What is that? What is that? Oh. Chuck? Oh my god, what is it? I try to stay calm and think about my next move with my emotions in check. It's a dead dog, they did and they tried to burn it. It was hard for me to accept what I was seeing here. Wait a minute. Are you sure that's a dog? Yeah, here's the, they tried to burn it with this. No, I, I think they did some kind of ritual. This dog. Are you sure it's a dog, not a pig? Has been. Well, are you sure it's a dog? Burned alive. Oh my God. There's his head. I don't like this. Because these There's sticks, the dog's look, head. these sticks are only burnt on the very end, so it's almost like they were doing some kind of satanic ritual. These are only burnt on the very end. See that? Every one of them. Every one of these sticks are burnt on the very end. And if they were trying to start a fire, this would have started. It's light cedar. Well, what were they so doing? this is crazy. What were they doing to this poor dog? I don't know. Well, I hope it's just a dog that's out here and I not can... some kind of other... Actually, I can smell that this dog has been burned. Ugh. This dog. They don't, yeah. You don't just burn a dog with these sticks like this. Well, so, uh. When I searched through earlier episodes, a troubling picture began to emerge. A lot of the strange activity seemed to center in this same area. Yeah. That's crazy. Bones, but it looks like a... This is like a vertebrae I've not seen oh, no. before. We're gonna, we better take these bones. We're going to take them. It's like you're being followed or something. Ho, ho! Ho! I don't know. We're almost back. We gotta, we're getting closer. The activity always seems to be near the tree crossing and close to the trailhead near the end of our journey. Some of our discoveries 
seems suspicious in a whole new light now. Started several fires in the area. This is an Easter I'll not soon forget ever. This is an Easter we won't forget. This is where they built another fire. Hey, hey, Nancy. Oh. It's still smoking. Then someone drove by us. I did not see who it was. I will say that the scariest animals ever found on the planet, by far, are human beings. This channel is about real life events that take place during our expeditions. We knew when we journeyed into the mountains that Easter Sunday that the Lord had revealed the truth to us and protected us at the same time. For that we are so thankful. Our next episode is the full version of our two-day expedition. Nancy went on her first night hunt tracking a mountain lion. We finally made a successful descent to the lake and it was beautiful. We want to share these moments with our viewers like you. So join us if you'd like. We'd love to have you along.